All right, I'm on hole number 15. What do we got going here? Hole number 15 is a par five. We, this is our midterm. We got a serious look at Alvi here. Okay, coming to the spot down here. Trying to get down into this spot. Bring it home with a sniper. And I am, um, I'm working this shot down here at the end. So I'm still working these shots. But I know on the drive, I'm using a QB, I'm using a sniper, and I'm doing two and a half backspin. So I'm using my accurate bag, QB, sniper. I'm using a season 17 ball. And that is all that I need. You could do the same shot with a Guardian. It's just the rings will be a little bit bigger when you're taking the shot down on the end. But you have options if you bring a Guardian. So if you get down there and you're not quite in your sniper range, but you have a Guardian, number one, it hits a little bit farther. So it'll be more likely to be in the range. And number two, if you're just out of the range, you can go to the left and then do the backspin, side spin curl and get on and get your eagle. Max in about two and a half. Let's not be. Be three rings off, two, two. And add on a little about two four. I'll put some curl on it to bring it back to the fairway. Hit it great on the inside so it'll come way back to the fairway. Bleed up there to the top. I left myself, you can see when it comes around that band and it's and the curls engaging, how it's engaging this part of this part of the rough down here because it's coming in here and then it comes real close to it because it bounces over that section where it, the rough kicks out so if you don't leave yourself three rings there and you leave yourself two rings and you're doing a curl shot like that where you're adding curl on then it tends to want to pinch up against that and you'll end up if you hit a great to the right you'll end up clipping that and get sunk out there so whenever you have a shot that you have to add curl to, it's always best to like move out a little bit. Give yourself more room for that curl to become effective. All right. Are we in the zone? We are just barely in the zone. <laughs> So I'm saying if you brought a guardian, you'd be you'd have a better shot of always being in the zone. Right at three, two, six. I'm going to take three off, two, three. Three, that's a little less than two. Hit it perfect. Hitting it perfect. Let's see if that's the right, right spot. <laughs> just a little too much speed. Ah, I took 10% off. <laughs> just a little too much speed. See if my opponent can get up there. Oh. You can see if I was an any further back than where I was, I that shot, I would have had to put a little bit of overpower on that shot. And that's the worst thing that we'd want to do. Uh, I suppose there could be worse things, but we definitely wouldn't want to do that. Getting it perfect in the hole. All right. Another birdie.
<laughs> I came to this hole to get a birdie and I got a birdie. I got, I, I got to repeat that mantra because I've had some holes that I've had problems with. And the deal is, is I'm looking at the, I'm looking at the next shot, trying to pick that next shot up. And then I epic failed the hole and you can't allow that to happen. You need to play one shot at a time and go out there and set yourself up in the right spot so that you have that next shot. The way you should look at it is you go out there and you, you take a shot and you're all serious about it. And then you get to the next shot and you go, wow, I got an Albie shot right here. Wow, I wish I had that club. Wow, I do have that club. Wow, I wish I had this ball. Wow, I do have that ball. <laughs> you have everything that you need. It's a draw third anniversary I will forfeit not falling for that alright what hole was that where are we we're on hole number 15 And that was it. So what can we possibly do here? We got a one, two, three, four. So we're on track for the 24. And hole number 16 is the par three we have a hole in one shot at in this quadrant. At par four, we def we have I have got to get it. This is the deal. I went from the zero up on the top. This is a hole that I should have an eagle on every time. So the 24 should be in the bag and the eagle on hole number 8 and 17, that's 26. And then it's something else to pick something up. That's why this shot on hole number 2 right here hurts so bad because right now this should be a 2. Okay. And then I, this is, you get a 2, you get a 1, 2, 2 here. And that, that one hole drop takes you from a banner to... You know, maybe a top 10, just having one brain fart. <laughs> you can't allow that stuff to happen. The minimum score is the, the, the whole deal. And I know that I say that all the time and probably minus 24, that's the goal. If you shoot for the minus 24 and you put yourself in the right spot, it, it literally is, hey, you're in the right spot. You're in the perfect place to pick that up. So these next three holes, I can definitely get back on track. All right. That was hole number 15 of the third anniversary tournament. Thanks for watching.